What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm a high priestess intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading. Caps to side to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages to resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading for uh, Sonic Capricorn for mid June of 2022. Thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. We're at 13,030 subscribers, so thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 5. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash app, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate. I do not publicly display how much you donate or um, your name for privacy and confidentiality purposes. Um, just let everybody know, okay? Um, I'm feeling a little nauseous and sick, sick to my stomach, so hopefully this reading won't be too long, which I hardly ever get sick or feel sick or any of that, but I feel nauseous and sick to my stomach um, right now. But of course, as an empath, I absorb energy, so maybe one of you guys, maybe you're nauseous or you feel sick to your stomach. Uh, there's a reason I'm feeling, and I just, the feeling just came over me, like, it wasn't that way before I clicked the camera on. So maybe one of you guys is nauseous. Maybe you're nauseous. Maybe you're feeling sick, um, have nausea or vomiting or something like that. I haven't vomited, but I don't know. You plug it in how it resonates. Um, I did receive one channel message as I was meditating on your energy for mid-June of 2022. Um, these are psychic intuitive messages, so it's very important to only take the messages that resonate leave the rest. One may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply, none may apply. Only know, you know your specific story and situation, not anybody else, so you plug it in how it resonates. Okay, so the channel message I received was, um, oh shoot, hold on, I forgot. Brain fart. Give me a second. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, energy sharing has backfired and it's going to continue to backfire. That's what I heard. That's what it was. Energy sharing has backfired and it's going to continue to backfire. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. And I've been pulling in binding spell energy. Very, very, very heavy for um, um, our signs. Very heavy. So some kind of energy sharing has backfired and it's going to continue to backfire. So that could be somebody energy trying to energy share and energy suck off you, Capricorn, if you're high vibrational or if you're low vibrational and you're on the dark side or was on the dark side, it could be you, it could be it backfiring on you, energy sharing and binding spell S type energy. Maybe one of you guys is nauseous or feeling nauseous or feeling sick to your stomach. I mean, I, I never feel this way. Never. And trust me, there's no way I could be freaking pregnant. That'd be a freaking immaculate conception. So it's not that. I mean, I never feel down usually. Usually. I'm usually a very healthy person. So I don't know. You plug it in how it resonates. Spirit messages you have for sign caps. A toxic vacation is about to go very awry. A toxic vacation is about to go very awry. So energies can be reversed. So it doesn't have to be your toxic vacation. It can be somebody you're connected to's toxic vacation. But somebody's toxic vacation is about to go awry. Now, if everybody doesn't know, awry means um, the other way. Not the way they expected. Like, left. 
So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, some kind of toxic vacation energy. It can be your vacation that you are um, are about to participate in or somebody else's. High honor. Number 25 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 25. It could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number in one's life. Number 25. We have zebra and hummingbird. Um, for some, you could be dealing with another earth sign or an air sign. If you are, they could have um, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Sun, Moon, Jupiter, Jupiter charts. If you are tiger, doing something risky, taking a chance, barrel, you feel something is lacking in your life, perhaps love, money, or gold, key successful outcome to your problem. Okay, so I heard some kind of um, energy sharing is backfiring. So somebody's an energy succubus, whether it's you or somebody you're connected to. Somebody's an energy succubus. And they obviously practice on the dark side. I'm feeling binding spell energy. I didn't hear that, but I strongly, strongly feel binding spell energy. So it's either backfiring on you or somebody you're connected to. You plug it in, how it resonates. Zebra. Cancer is about to become very, very, very significant in Capricorn's life. Cancer is about to become very significant in a Capricorn's life. You plug it in how it resonates. For one, it's somebody you're connected to. Okay, Eric, for one of you guys, it's somebody you're connected to. So, I feel like cancer, cancer, like cancer. So, for one of you guys, it's somebody you're connected to. Um, it could be a new diagnosis of cancer, or it could be um, in remission and it comes back. However, that resonates. But some kind of cancer, however, that resonates. Um, whatever kind of cancer that is, I'm not sure. And I don't think we're talking about the sign cancer here. I think we're talking about, like, the disease cancer. Um, now, like I said, I don't know what kind of cancer it is. Um, I didn't hear that. Whatever kind it is. And I don't know what stage it is. Um, so, you plug it in how it resonates. For some, it could be an earth sign um, that's um, with cancer or somebody else. You plug it in how it resonates. A Capricorn is about to see severe true colors in a person soon. For some, it's their aunt. For some, it's their sister. For some, it's their mother. For some, it's their child. A Capricorn is about to see true colors in a um, particular person soon. For some, it's their aunt. For some, it's their sister. For some, it's their child. Um, you plug in how it resonates. A lot of feminine energy in here. A lot of um, aunt, sister, and child I heard. Um, you have to plug those in how it resonates if it does apply for you. But a lot of feminine energy, I'll tell you that. But true color energy. So, you, you know, you see how he has, um, the zebra has the third eye activation right there on his forehead. But it's all the colors of the rainbow in there. Um, or... Well, not all the colors of the rainbow. It's like colors of the rain, uh, of the wheel, of the color wheel in there. Um, true colors. I feel that's like the true colors. You're about to see the true colors of your aunt, your mother, or your um, sister, or your child. You plug it in how it resonates. Um, true colors. Like true nature, true colors. So no fake shit. Um, hashtag real shit. And for some, I feel it's not going to be what you want it to be. And I'm just being for real. Um, I really, really, really think that.
There is about to be particular buzzing around the town very soon. For some, a federal investigation is coming. Okay, there's about to be particular buzzing around the town soon. A federal investigation is coming. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. So hummingbirds are very loud and proud. They're beautiful and people love hummingbirds um, because they are, they're beautiful and they're very pleasant and people love to be around them. So some kind of federal investigation energy, um, it might be over this hummingbird energy, um, somebody that somebody loves to be around or something that happened. And this is like buzz, 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 buzz around the town. Like, oh my God. Um, let me tell you what happened. Buzz, 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 buzz. You plug it in how it resonates. Someone's about to be called out very publicly for defamation of character of someone in the past. A family is about to be highly embarrassed soon. Someone's about to be called out for defamation very publicly for defamation of character in the past. And a toxic family is about to be very publicly embarrassing. So um, you plug it in how it resonates it could be an earth sign or a um, air sign in this toxic family or a toxic um earth sign or air sign about to be called out i'm not sure only you know your story not anybody else you plug it in how it resonates with some kind of defamation of character energy and um someone about to be called out very publicly um they're in a toxic family dynamic i'll tell you that right now so you plug it in how it resonates Tiger doing something risky, taking a chance. A Capricorn took a huge risk in the past. For one, it was because of money. However, it has blew up in your face, but you knew you shouldn't have done it. A Capricorn took a risk in the past. It was whoever this Capricorn is, Caps, whoever you are. Only you know if you did this or not. Um, one of you guys took a risk in the past for money, I heard. So it was strictly for money. It was money-based. Whatever the hell chance that was. But I heard it blew up in your face. Huge, huge, huge bad idea. You knew it was. And it's going to continue to blow up in your face. Huge, huge, huge bad idea. It's going to continue to blow up in your face. So it was some kind of money risk you took. I think it was a bad investment. Um, for some, I feel it could have been illegal. And I'm just being for real. I mean, I, I'm just calling you, calling it how I see it. And for some, I strongly feel it was illegal. It was illegal and you, you, you knew you shouldn't have done it. But you did it for my, the love of money. But I heard it's basically backfiring. It's going to continue to backfire. So... Doing something risky, taking a chance, the risk didn't, it didn't pan out. And it doesn't sound like it's going to continue to pan out, um, whoever you are and how this flies. And another Capricorn is about to help transmute the energy. They know it was a horrible risk. And another Capricorn is about to help transmute the energy. They know it was a horrible risk. So one of you guys took the risk for the money or something money related or some kind of investment or something uh, how that resonates you you're highly intuitive you realize it was a shitty ass mistake basically it was a shitty ass mistake shitty ass decision you shouldn't have done it one you're about to transmute the energy so you're about to transmute it to benefit you or you and other people um in some shape form or fashion you knew it was a shitty ass risk but you did it anyways for the love of money Beryl, you feel something is lacking in your life, perhaps love, money, or goals? A third-party situation is about to become very significant in Capricorn's life. 
a third party situation is about to become very significant in Capricorn's life. So some kind of third party situation, um, that could be your, you in the middle of a third party, or you put somebody in the middle of a third party, or you're hearing about a third party, some kind of third party situation, ship, sneaking link, um, situation, however that resonates. Okay. So you feel something is lacking your life. I think that's love there. Um, because that's lack of respect. That, if anybody puts anybody in a third party, now I don't know if you put somebody in third party caps or they put you in it. But how that resonates, that's disrespectful as hell. Don't want to be with somebody, just damn tell them and don't be with them. Just period, point blank, period. I mean, it's really, it's not hard. And I'm to be for real. I've done it many times in my life. I've had it done to me. I mean, and that's just the damn truth. Don't fucking lie. And I'm just being for real. A very significant argument with an Aries is about to become very, very, very significant for one. And a very significant argument with a Libra. And for one, a Sagittarius. Okay, so a very significant argument. It sounds like for at least one or two of you guys with an Aries, for, for one or two of you guys with a Sag, one or two, one or two of you guys with a Libra. So um, I feel for some it could be your partner or the third party you're about to get into the argument with or anybody else. Maybe it's this person. Maybe for some you collaborated and took a risk. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. But however that resonates, um, you're about to get into an argument with somebody. Some an Aries, some a Sag, some a Libra. It can be masculine or femme, Aries, Sag, or Libra. They could have Aries, Sag, or Libra in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or femme, and Hamer, Jupiter charts. But, okay, so somebody took a risk, money-wise, in the past. It didn't pan, pan out. So you feel something is lacking your life with the money, obviously. For some, you're in, you either put somebody in a third party or they put you in the third party. So that's the, you feel something is lacking your life with love. Um, and goals, only you know if you're lacking goals or motivation or something of that nature. Um, there's some kind of energy sharing backfiring. So if you're on the negative spectrum of that and you are on the dark side and you put a binding spell on somebody and you're trying to energy suck off of them, just know it's not going to, your goal there is not going to pan out, whoever you are. For some, you're highly intuitive. You already know it's not. For some, maybe, hopefully you'll wake the hell up and realize it. You plug it in how it resonates, you guys. And I hate to use energy sucking and energy sharing as a goal, but I do think that is at least one Caps' goal, or it used to be. And that's pretty damn shitty goals in life when that's your goal. I just want to make that clear. A Capricorn is about to start a social media platform soon. A Capricorn is about to start a social media platform soon. Wow. Well, you go with your bad self, Caps. Now, I didn't hear what kind of social media platform. You know, there's a bazillion out there. There's a bazillion. There's um, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Parlay. There's YouTube. I mean, a bazillion. So, whatever kind of social media platform you're about to start, Capricorn, um, you plug in and how it resonates. Now, I will tell you for YouTube, Excuse me. If you're going to use YouTube as a platform for a business, you have to have at least thousand a thousand subscribers before you can um, monetize. Um, just to let everybody know for that. Uh, if it is business oriented, there for some it could just be um, just like a Facebook or something like that, where you just want to post your fun pictures or use it as a um, speaking platform that's non-monetized or what have you. I'm not sure. Only you know your situation, not anybody else. Okay. Successful outcome to your problem. Workers' compensation fraud is about to become very significant in a Capricorn's life. Workers' compensation fraud is about to become very significant in a Cap's life. So it could be somebody frauded you or you frauded somebody else. But some kind of workers' compensation fraud or maybe you're investigating worker, workmen's compensation fraud. 
Um, how that resonates in one's life, Capricorn, okay? A uh, traveling home, traveling business, home travel agency business is business. It's about to be shut down. It's just not making revenue. And a motorcycle gang is about to become significant in a Capricorn's life. A motorcycle gang. You plug it in, how it resonates. Um, okay. So, okay. So, for one of you guys, a home travel agency business is about to be shut down. Heard it's just not making revenue. So, it's not making revenue. It's not bringing driving in business. Uh, I guess people don't want this travel agency services. Um, it could be your travel agent, home travel agency business, or somebody you're connected to is home travel agency business. Um, but... It's not, it's just not making money. It's not driving in people, um, business, um, the way it, it needs to, to survive basically. So it could be yours or somebody you're connected to. I heard it's about to be shut down. That's for at least one of you guys. And for one of you guys, a motorcycle gang is about to become significant in your life. I hope this isn't, um, like, what is it? Um, not Sons of Anarchy. Oh, well, that's the motorcycle gang in the. Um, what is it called? The TV show? Um, damn it. Um, is it Sons of Anarchy? It's with the motorcycle gang. Um, that's the TV show. Reminds me of the motorcycle gang in there. I think it's called Sons of Anarchy. Sons of Anarchy. But anyways, um, I digress. But my, my point is, that's a TV show. This is real life. Somebody, a motorcycle gang is about to become significant. So, I feel that can be an illegal motorcycle gang or a real lot. I mean, like illegal, like street crime, street side shit, or not. I don't know. I don't affiliate with motorcycle gangs. So, however that resonates and applies in one's life, they're Capricorn. I would never affiliate and associate with motorcycle gangs, but everybody has that free will and right to live their, and choose to live their life however the hell they want to live. and. One of you guys apparently likes affiliating with motorcycle gangs, or you're about to, or somebody you're connected to. However that resonates. Maybe you feel they're the successful outcome to your problem, or they're going to be. Hopefully, they don't commit crime or crimes. I just want to make that clear, or help you commit crime or crimes. I'm not judging anybody in this, but it doesn't. Why am I feeling sick in my stomach and nauseous? I never do. And why are we talking about motorcycle things? And we're pulling up successful outcome to your problem. I feel you think they're going to help you solve something or they are going to help you solve something. But I don't know, man. I'm No judgments. I'm moving on. Retirement is about to become significant in a Capricorn's life soon. Retirement is about to become significant in a Capricorn's life soon. So you plug it in how it resonates. And a Capricorn is about to make a very, very, very important phone call to the state soon. Very important phone call. Abuse of a family and an individual in the past. Okay, so retirement is about to become significant for one Capricorn soon. That could be you or somebody you're connected to. And a Capricorn is about to make a very important phone call to the state soon, I heard, for um, abuse of a family and um, an, in, an individual in the past. So that could be your successful outcome to your problem as well. The retirement energy for some and for some, the significant important phone call to um, the state regarding abuse of a person or family in the past. 
however that resonates and applies Capricorn. And um, you have high honor. So I think you're going to get high honor for reporting this abuse of this family or um, this uh, family or um, individual in the past, however that resonates. Wolf. A very shysty Piscean energy is about to be called out very soon. Okay, I heard a very shysty Piscean energy is about to be called out soon. So I think they're like a wolf in sheep's clothing. It's exactly what I think with the wolf card. I think they're wolf in sheep's clothing. I heard they're very shy, steep, I see an energy. I think you're about to call them out or somebody you're connected to is about to call them out. Um, I, I think we're pulling up wolf because they're wolf in sheep's clothing. For some, they could be connected to the secret seven because um, we have wolf energy. Um, and that can be the secret seven. I have been pulling in secret seven. Or it just can be they're a wolf in sheep's clothing. However, that resonates, um, but it's heavy Piscean energy. It can be masculine or feminine Pisces. For some, it's a Libra. For some, it's a Libra. So for some, it's a Pisces. For some, it's a Libra. Masculine or feminine Pisces. Masculine or feminine Libra. But I'm feeling this is wolf in sheep's clothing or secret seven. I didn't hear a secret seven in here. You have to take it out. Resonates. Are you affiliated with secret seven or not? But however that resonates, um, you're you, I, you're about to call them out. I feel you're about to call them out or somebody you're connected to is. You're about to rip the bitch off rip the mask off and you're about to see clearly or you already have seen clearly and you're about to stand up to this pisces or this libra whoever you are and how this resonates in one's life capricorn only you know your story not anybody else someone's about to see the term wolf pack in a conversation soon it is about to trigger their intuition like nobody's business. Someone's about to see the term wolf pack in a conversation soon, and it's about to trigger their intuition like nobody's business. So I feel that might be you, Caps, or somebody you're connected to. But one of you guys is about to, I, I heard you're about to see the term wolf pack, so I think you're about to see it written down, like on a sticky note or a memo pad or a, text message or a group chat or a email or something like that um i don't think it's something somebody's gonna say is what i'm saying verbal i think it is something that's written down um i heard the term wolf pack so secret seven just saying just saying high honor A Capricorn is about to get huge high honor very soon. One Capricorn's intuition is already spiked. One is about to. They're about to realize significant information was really, really hidden from a fire sign feminine. They're about to deliver it in a huge way for to for one. For one, they're about to get the information to delivered to her. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So if this resonates for you, Caps, I heard you're about to get high honor. So you are, there's some kind of information that for some you've already realized this information has not gotten to this fire sign fam. For some you're about to realize realize that your intuition has already peaked or it's about to. Um, and you're about to realize this information has not gotten to her. Um, it has strategically been hidden. You know this. It has strategically been hidden. You know this. So you know this information has strategically been hidden from her. So someone strategically hid this information from her. It's probably regarding money or something positive in her life or something like that. I mean, because that's why karmics do shit like that. That's why karmics do shit like that. Um, they hide strategic information or strategic information or strategic positive things from person, people, place, or situation because they don't want 
somebody to one up them or to do better than them or to look better than them or or blase 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 but thing is it's not their damn life it's not their life it's not their damn life so they need to stay the hell out of other people's lives and go focus on their own damn life and then maybe when we wouldn't have so many damn problems in the world and that's just damn true but whoever you are i feel you think the same as that way whoever you are one, I heard you're going to deliver it to the fire sign fam. So the Aries Leo side to feminine energy. One, you're going to um, get it to deliver, delivered to her. So however you get it delivered to her, it could be through another person or it could be snail mail or email or text or group chat or something like that. How that resonates. But one, you're, it sounds like you are going to take the action to get it delivered to her now you could send somebody to get it delivered to her like through the mail or certified mail or something like that or you could do it yourself or how that resonates i guess um you could send a messenger hell i don't know i'm not you only you know your story not anybody else but for some you're, you're well for one it sounds like you're gonna do it you're gonna do it and for one you're gonna get somebody to do it you're gonna have the information sent to her so i don't know if you're gonna get somebody to send it to her or you're gonna send it mail or whatever hell i don't know i don't freaking know you only you know your story not anybody else so you plug it in how it resonates there capricorn just saying just saying okay but i think it's a successful outcome to your problem whatever the hell it is okay A Capricorn is about to find out their child is pregnant. For some, it's an adult. For some, it is a teenager. A Capricorn is about to find out their child is pregnant. For some of you guys, it's an adult child. For some, it is a teenager. So teenagers, minors are tw uh, like 13 to 17. So whoever this minor energy is, um, obviously I feel they're feminine energy or they have feminine masculine parts. But I feel they're 13 to 17, if that resonates for you. And I feel it's your child. Um, probably a biological child. For some, it could be a foster child. Um, and for some, um, it is an adult child. So you have an adult child. Either your biological child or your foster child. You plug it in, how it resonates there, Capricorn. All right, I love you guys. I hope this helped, and I'll be safe.